Hey, my name is Toby and I'm a wildlife biologist here at the Toronto Zoo working on our native bat conservation program. There's more than 1,400 different species of bats around the world living on every continent except for Antarctica. And eight of those can be found right here in Ontario. And seven of them we found in our backwoods here at the zoo. Bats have an incredibly diverse range of diets. There are bats that eat insects, bats that eat fruit, bats that eat nectar, bats that go fishing, and even bats that eat other vertebrate animals, including other bats, and most famously, the vampire bats which feed on blood. Bats are also unique for being the only flying mammals. You might have heard of other flying mammals like flying lemurs or flying squirrels, but those animals just glide, they're just falling slowly. Whereas bats are capable of true powered flight, uh, they can move around in three dimensions. A bat's wing is made up of the same structure as our hands. They just have elongated finger bones and a skin membrane between them, which means that bats fly by the power of jazz hands. Flight opens up a lot of opportunities that would otherwise be unavailable to bats. It allows them to catch flying insects that they wouldn't be able to get to, and it allows them to move around a lot more easily, flying between fruit trees or flying long distances to find a suitable place to live in the summer and the winter. But if there are so many bats flying about, you might wonder why uh, we're not seeing any about now. Uh, and of course that's because bats are nocturnal and they like to fly in the dark. Uh, and we'll talk more about how that works tomorrow. <laughs>